birthday trip. And yes, it's only a four-day trip, but I'm the type of person who will pack a whole suitcase with 20 different outfits. So I have plenty to choose from. And this suitcase is pretty heavy. I know I'm, I'm ODing right now. But yeah, I think I got everything that I need. And let's go on this road trip. <laughs> That's my first time trying DQ. I heard that, um. Whoa. Guys, I did get a cake. It's a strawberry shortcake. It was very delicious. I decided to just add this clip in here real quick. So you come in through the entry door and then the first thing you see is the pool table and there's a sauna over there. And then, oh my God, they're playing Billie Eilish. This is the room. So guys, I had to mute right there to avoid copyright, but basically I was saying I came through the front door around to the room, the jacuzzi is down those stairs and then we're back where the pool table is at and that's the sauna. And then right here is where the kitchen is at. And then from the kitchen, we have two closets on the side with, you know, utilities and whatever we need. And then here is the bathroom. And this place is in Pennsylvania. So guys, I'm trying to figure out if I should use the color fusion over the rainbow palette. It has a lot of pretty colors. A lot of pretty colors. Or should I just use my handy dandy Juvia's palette? These are the only two eyeshadow palettes I have. And that's how you know I don't wear eyeshadow that often. Because I only got two palettes, okay? And this one was a birthday gift to me. This one. One of I think I'm gonna do neutral colors, so because I'm I'm only planning to do like one color eyeshadow. So I think I'm gonna use this. I think I'm only gonna do two colors, and I think I'm gonna do Ada and Zulu. So let's see. I'm not good with eyeshadow, so I don't know how this is gonna turn on. So guys, I then started with my baby skin pore eraser and I put that all over my face and then I'm just going to take my orange concealer um, by LA Girl Pro Orange Concealer, the corrector, and I'm just going to put that around my dark areas, which is usually around my mouth. And then I'm just going to try to color correct. I don't usually do this, but I did it once and I think it worked a little bit. So yeah, I'm then going to take my mat. Anyway, I'm going to take my MAC Studio FX foundation and I'm just going to put that on my face. I'm going to get a brush, a flat foundation brush, and then I'm just going to blend that all in into my skin. And also, don't forget to put some on your neck, okay? Then I'm going to get this cheap-ass beauty blender. I have my Real Techniques one, but I left it. But good thing I had that one that I bought at the beauty supply store. It doesn't blend well. But I just blended the foundation. Then I'm going to take LA Girl Pro Concealer Medium Beige and Fawn. I'm going to put the medium beige like on the places where I highlight. Like under my eyes, my nose, my forehead, and my chin. And then I'm going to put some Fawn Concealer on top of that. The medium beige like is a good highlighter. But I don't like my face like too light. So I just added some Fawn to blend it in. Then I'm going to take that same beauty sponge, beauty blender sponge. And then I'm just going to blend that out. Next, I took my Sasha Buttercup powder and I put it on all the areas where I highlighted and I like to brush it away right away. I don't like to bake. I just don't like it. Then I'm going to take this MAC powder. It's the same shade as my foundation. I'm just going to put that over top the highlights just not to make it too, too light. 
but then I don't really contour but I'm just gonna contour my nose this is a part of my birthday gift along with the other palette that I was planning to use this little pointy brush here. I'm gonna do use this nose Guys, I have a question. Can you set your face with this? The Mari Modesco spray. Can you set your makeup with this? I don't know if it's for like my skincare or if it's to set my makeup. For my highlighter, I'm gonna use Physicians Formula Butter Highlighter. I just saw it in the pharmacy and picked it up. I could use the highlighter from here. I could have been using these brushes and not my old brushes. I thought it would have a fan brush in there, but it's from Six Six Plus. It's off Amazon. It this was one of my gifts with with this. These all in one gift from one person. So yeah, and I don't have eyeshadow palette. <laughs> Only got one eyeshadow palette, which is the Juvia's palette. So we got another one. I don't contour, but I got this. I thought there would be a brush that I could use to highlight in here. I mean, I, I could use one of these, but. I don't know the look when the lip liner is showing, but they got lip gloss on, but it's kind of blended. That's what I'm trying to do, but it ain't blending. I'm just gonna stick to regular lip gloss. I know how to put contacts on with my nails, but I tried using this tool one time and it was pretty easy, so why not just use it? So for my hair, I like to get the comb and like where the part is, I like to comb it upwards. As you see that I'm doing right here, I like to like hold it up. So when it falls, it has the like this hump to it or like this bump, like you guys, you guys know what I mean. So when it like falls, it has a bump. Then I got some um, wax stick just to let it, like to hold it a little bit more. Then I'm gonna go over that again with the hot comb. Well, with the wand, with the curling wand to make sure like that parting area is flat on my head. So I'm getting my mousse. And I left my spray bottle with my, um, for my water and my leave-in conditioner. Cause that's what I usually spray in the hair. I'm just gonna add some water to this. My makeup look for my birthday is complete, I think. Is it complete? So let's go on to the photo shoot, shall we? So I'm taking my pictures right here 
in this spot and this is what I'm using when I click this button it takes the pictures so I put my phone here or I have my phone right here as well so yeah I'm using my phone to record this video so y'all not gonna be able to see me taking the pictures but I will be putting the pictures like on the screen so so enjoy me struggling at playing pool while you look at the photos I took and yeah if you want to see like all the photos i posted them on my instagram you guys could go follow me at tiani renee t-i-o-n-n-e -N -E underscore r-e-n-e-e -E. now just enjoy this clip of me struggling to play pool follow me on instagram and i enjoyed my night i enjoyed my birthday week and i just i'm just grateful the end of the video i did go ahead and hop in the jacuzzi but i hope you guys enjoyed this video as i enjoyed my birthday thank you guys for watching